What's up, what's going on, guys? Geek Santa Fe, and today we're going to be reading the Flashpoint issue too. Um, I know this isn't getting much views, and I don't care because I like reading comics. It's kind of getting me to read more comics, and um, I'm just going to be starting off with the big kind of stuff. I'm going to do Flashpoint, Crisis, um, Crisis on Infinite Earths, Infinite Crisis, stuff like that. So there is a big difference between Crisis on Infinite. There is a difference between Crisis on Infinite. Crisis on Infinite Earths and Infinite Crisis, and we'll go into that whenever I've finished Flashpoint, but yeah. This is issue one of Flashpoint. If you don't know what happened last time, then make sure you go check it out. Uh, my comic reading, I'll leave a link in the description. Ding, 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 that's the sh ship coming, sailing through the waters, and that's it, and, sitting, and on that ship, there's a... Uh, there's, um, Deathstroke and his men. Deathstroke says, what's so nasty down there? The Gimp's not seeing anything, Deathstroke. I've been sending currents into his sad, sad ass ever since we sh shang uh, shangade him. Shangade him either. We burnt him out or there's something interesting with his powers. Zap him again. No, no, please. Electric, electric heal. No more. And then his... And then you see him getting fucking electrocuted and shit. I don't see any sunk, sunken banks or museums down there. Don't see nothing but white blobs. Slade. We've got another ship out there. Get to the guns. Mishite. I am so terrible at fucking pronunciation. I see their flag. It's Warlord. If Plasmus is still on Morgan's crew, we're gonna need Icicle up here pronto. If you... Now Icicle's an amazing fucking character, and then as you see the ship's getting, uh, well it seemed like a, uh, a band, like a fucking shipwreck there, with a load of bloody men and just people dead and shit, and put someone in the sea there as you can see. What happened? They sailed too far inland, Clayface, and so did we. Flashpoint, chapter 2 of 5. Jeff Johns, writer, Andy Cooper, penciler, Sandra Herb, Inc. Inca, Alex Sank, Sinclair, colorist, Nick J, and all them. Make sh shout out to all these people that are involved in the flash this Flashpoint storyline. Everyone to their stations. We need to turn this ship around. You're obviously not working with Wonder Woman and her Amazons. But that doesn't mean you're not our enemies, Ocean Master. Oh, okay. Ocean Master was one hell of a fucking character, I'm telling you now. Yes, my brother. No survivors. Gotham City. My God. That night in Crime Alley. Bruce wasn't killed, wasn't he? Instead of you. What are you, what are you doing here? Ah. Fuck me. And then Bat uh, I think it's... Is it? Yeah, it's Batman that uh, ends up uh, breaking his fucking fingers there. You broke my finger, almost broke my arm. I'm going to break every bone in your body until you tell me who the hell you are and why the hell you are here. Did the Joker send you? What? No. My name is Barry Allen, but like you, I have another identity. I'm the Flash. After I struck by a bolt of lightning, I became the fastest man alive. You were fast enough to avoid that, you, you delusional son of a bitch. Oi, oi, fucking... Wait, 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 back up. Look how monstrous... Batman looks there, fuck me. Anyway, that's because I don't have my powers, Dr. Wayne. And no one remember, remembers there even being a Flash. I'm not your enemy, and I need your help. You came to the wrong place. Oh my god, Batman's not listening at all, and he's fucking whacking Barry over the head. I must be a diff uh, on a different Earth, or trapped in one of Mirror Master's mirror worlds. Get up. Oh my god. Batman's fucking him up. Uh, Barry's kind of witnessing uh, the uh, memories of this timeline now by the looks of it. It happened last year. Aquaman and Atlantis flooding Europe. And before that, Wonder Woman leading the Amazons on a blitz blitzkrieg in London. My memories are changing. This isn't a parallel Earth or a mirror world. This is home. This is real. Mate, that's fucking Reverse Flash's logo in one eye, and then uh, Barry's in the other, I kind of like that. That's the first thing you've said, that mate, that's made sense. And then he sees the ring. My ring. I'll show you I'm telling the truth about who I am. I can prove it. 
I keep my uniform hidden in a compartment in this ring. It's made of a friction proof material that expands on contact with the air. And then, and then, he, and then he opens the top of his ring and this suit fucking comes out. This isn't... He could be watching us right now, moving so fast he's invisible. Who? The man this uniform belongs to. Eobar Fawn. What kind of name is Eobar? One, fr one from the future. He's a scientist from the 20th century who became obsessed with the power I have had. He turned himself into his own era's fastest man alive by replacing the accident that transformed me into a living kinetic engine. He calls himself Professor Zoom, the Reverse Flash. The Reverse Flash? Why would his uniform be inside your ring? And how the hell does it even fit in there? It's in there because Farm put it there. He wants me to know he's behind this. He's taunting me, like always. You're more paranoid than the Joker. You belong in Arkham. I'm not crazy, Dr. Wayne. Farn's as fast as I used to be, and he can do things I never could. He can change history. My mother was murdered when I was ten, and my father was convicted for it. I spent my life studying forensics to prove he was in, in, innocent and to catch my mother's real killer. But my father died in prison, and I never found a suspect. Until I became the Flash, and I discovered my entire life had been targeted by an enemy I hadn't even made yet. It was revenge in reverse. Fawn can travel through time. He was the one that killed my mother, but she's alive now. There's no doubt Fawn's altered history again. Everything was gone to hell. No one ever heard of Superman or commands at war with Wonder Woman. What about Bruce? You called me Bruce when you came in here. That's because in the world I know, you were shot and killed instead of him. Bruce became Batman to wage war against crime in Gotham City. Bruce survived? Your son was one of the closest friends, is one of my closest friends. If you're telling the truth, can you change this? Can you change it back so that I died and Bruce lived? I need to find a reverse flash, figure out what he did, and force him to revert history to what it was. Can you really change this world? I have to. Well, first things first, Dr. Wayne. I need my speed. Before I forget everything I knew. London, New Femiscara. So New Femiscara is kind of the home of where Wonder Woman is. So, so yeah, if you don't know. But if you do, then... Yeah. Where the hell are you? Bruh. <laughs> don't know why I said that, but yeah. I'm I'm at the Rendezvous, Rendezvous Rendezvous. I'm at the Rendezvous, but there's no sign of you or any of the other members of the Resistance. And I'm up to my neck in Amazons. Jeez, fucking bullets are flying off this, uh, this person's uh, braces thing. Which is kind of one of the things that the Amazons can do. They can do that and the fucking break, bullets will fly off the thing. And Wonder Woman, she can like create a blast when she does that and hits them both together. If any of you can hear me, I need backup. Immediate, I can tell by your accident you're an American. Wait, what? But you're going to tell me a little bit more about yourself. Who are you? Uh, he's resisting the lasso of truth. How is that possible, Queen Diana? It's not. Who are you and what are you doing in New Femiscira? My, 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 my name is Colonel Steve Trevor at the, of the United States Special Forces. I'm here to find Lois Lane. Who is Lois Lane? Lois Lane is a Pulitzer Pulitzer uh, is a prize-winning reporter known for her exclusive interviews with the world's greatest superhumans. She's been embedded in New Femiscira for the last eight months, secretly gathering intel on you and the Amazon for Cyborg. Lane knows every move you're about to make. She requested extra extraction, and I volunteered. She she's on all. She's also one of the most beautiful women I've ever met. You're okay, looks like things got a fucking thing for Lois. Our counter spy was telling the truth. Cyborg is amazing, the outside world's superhumans, in an attempt to interfere with our war against Aquaman. Tell our insider she's proven herself to the Amazons. She'll be welcome here in the New World Order. And find me this Lois Lane. What do you wish us to do with Steve Trevor? And now Steve is worried. 
Now it's over the um, Wayne Manor. Lightning's over. Where's the Nin Hydrin? You're crazy. Fine, but where? To your right. Fine, but where is it? Oh, uh, what? Wait, what? Fine, but where is it? To your right. Dousing yourself with chemicals and plugging into a lightning rod is going to turn you into the fastest man alive. This, that's how I became the Flash the first time. They say lightning never strikes the same place twice. A lot of the things from the comics they have put in the movies, in the movie anyway, they say a lot of things. Now, why don't we pull the switch and find out? Batman, he sits on the chair, puts the uh, headpiece on top, and then Batman pulls the switch. And then lightning comes down, it's hitting the rod, and it zooms out as Barry's sitting in the chair. It's raining. Well, it's lightning around it, but it's not hitting the rod yet. Come on, I'm here. I'm right. And then he gets hit, and then the rod gets hit by lightning. And then it's going horribly wrong. Fucking, he, he sets on fire because of the chemicals. And then Batman tries to put him out uh, with his cape. And then you see that uh, when he get, when uh, Barry comes off the chair, that he's all burned. He's got third degree burns and crap. Next. A search for Superman. Flashpoint world map. So this is kind of like um, like the whole map that's in fucking thingy. Africa, guerrilla control, neutral territories, pirate trade routes, Brazil, Nazi occupied. So all of them. That's kind of cool. Oh, is that how the, this is how the design of the characters went? I'm guessing. So, so, in the next one, we will be reading issue, we're going to be reading issue 3 in the next one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this, smash the like in this video, subscribe if you're new, turn post notifications on for more, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.